what's your favorite city to date in and why? What's my favorite city to date in and why? Um, I would like to say that they're all the same and I love them all the same, you know, because like some people say, it doesn't matter where you go, if you're on, you're on, and, but that's not true. I'd be full of shit if I said that. Um, not that there's not amazing, I, I haven't found amazing women in every city, uh, but honestly, um, at this point, Eastern Europe, because I've been there a lot, I've dated there a lot, I really love women that love to be in their feminine, and I found some women in Eastern Europe that love to be in their feminine. When I was in Ukraine, when I was in Romania, particularly I've been in Romania a lot, uh, the women really want to be feminine for you, for their man. If you take care of them, they want to take care of you. They create a nice polarity and they love it. And they really, I remember one a Romanian woman, Irina said, uh, she's my friend's girlfriend, she said, you men are our champions. We need you. We, we believe in you. I mean, uh, we really want to be with you. And she said that's, the, that's what, her, in her opinion, she was actually Ukrainian, not Romanian. In her opinion, that's what the women she knew brought to the men. And it just lit the men in the room up to hear that from women. Because so much of the world today is, I don't need you. I can do it myself. Let's just, it's, it's almost like the women want to be business partners. I don't, I don't want, if I'm going to be with somebody long term, I don't want a business partner. I don't even want to call her my partner. If I'm, she's not my business partner. She's, she's, uh, she's, my, she's my woman, you know? And so I want to have that feeling we've got each other's back, that she's going to be feminine for me and I'll be masculine for her. That doesn't mean we can't switch roles on occasion. That doesn't mean she can't step into her masculine when I'm not around. That doesn't mean I can't be in my feminine. I, I, totally cultivated my family that's the third stage man but we polarize while we're together she can surrender to my masculine just as i can surrender to her feminine because in a weird sort of way they both happen you know the masculine may lead the tension the feminine often leads the emotional body you know of the relationship so romania is high on my list ukraine was high on my list uh, i want to get over to the latin american countries i really am interested in colombia i had a colombian girlfriend for a number of years and she was amazing. Colombian women are, to me, really beautiful too, and they have that same caring spirit. So Colombia's on my list. And another one that I haven't been to yet is Brazil. So Brazil is high on my list. And uh, I know you love Brazil. love Brazil. And so, uh, so there's that whole, I may end up living in one of these countries for a while. And I think that's a strong, that's why I, I love Miami, guys. Miami is amazing, because you got Cubans, you got Colombians, you got Romanians, you got Ukrainians, you got, you got the whole, Kit and caboodle here, you know, um, and uh, it's a pretty amazing place.